Daniel Webster once said, If we work upon marble, it will perish. If we work upon brass, time will efface it. If we rear temples, they will crumble into dust. But if we work upon immortal minds, if we imbue them with principles, with just the fear of God and love of our fellow men, we engrave on those tablets something which will brighten all eternity. It is easy to find in most bookstores many texts on life and life's journey. Few use easy and understandable terms to relate the means to create a life based on the Spirit's song. They tell stories and paint pictures of lives that are difficult to understand. They hide the essence of their thoughts amid myriad schemes and plots. What we need is a precise set of tools that will permit us to understand, to interpret, and to use to create our new tomorrow. What follows is a collection of such tools that will permit your life to develop according to the Spirit's principles and will allow you to create a life full of joy. Remember to enjoy each moment of your life. Enjoying the moment sets your life on a course that will provide a positive basis for living. Imagine how your world would change if you simply became appreciative of the opportunities presented to you each day. So much of the confusion and pain you see in life would disappear, and peace would be your way. You no longer would look with fear at the future, and would become a beacon that others could see. If you could do this, wouldn't your world change and in turn change the world of others you meet? Live your life in peace. How much time do you waste thinking of the future or of events that may never occur? How would your life change if you lived it from a peaceful center? Would you be frozen with fear and obsessed with trying to create a life that may not be possible? The truth is that if you live your life in peace, you will effortlessly move towards the direction of your heart's desires and create the life you envision. Remove sadness. Empty your soul of sorrow and pain and begin to rebuild your life with joy and love. Doing this will create an inner energy that will propel you towards your future. Too much time is spent dwelling on the unfortunate events of life resulting in pain and sorrow. Too little time is spent seeing the happiness that is sprinkled everywhere around you. Learn to empty your heart of sadness, sorrow, and pain, and you will become rejuvenated. Become mindful. Learn to become mindful of each event in your life and see how such events influence your life. Most people fail to look carefully at the direction and the events that life provides and become bogged down in the outer material world that is so easy to see. Watching events closely and being mindful permits us to see our lives in context and to manage our lives from a different and wondrous perspective. Watch your path closely and know that the way you are to travel is open in front of you. Realize that you are safe because you are a child of God and will be given any safety you may need. We do not live within a vacuum. We live within the energy field of the Creator and as such are constantly guided and influenced along our life's course. Our world is intertwined with the world of the Spirit. This creates an interconnection that allows our lives to become one with spirit. It is by realizing this interconnection to the flow of energy from spirit that keeps you safe and at peace. Be undeterred in your desire to follow the spirit's way and see your life change before your eyes. 
Following the Spirit's way in your life provides the peace, safety, and direction you need to fulfill the life set before you. It provides you with a pathway so that you will not lose your direction and thus sacrifice the outcome of your life. Become pure in heart and become an advocate of spirit in your life. We each must take the time to understand our beliefs and our belief structure because we use our beliefs to act as a scaffold to which we secure our lives. A pureness of heart prevents any interference with constructing this scaffold and thereby allows us to build our lives based on the Spirit's love. Love all humanity. Love removes the barriers we place between one another and provides a stillness to life that propels us toward our most cherished desires. Love acts as the glue that binds our lives together and provides the lubricant necessary for our growth to occur. Love releases energy and allows everyone you meet to feel its presence. Become like a child and see beauty all around you. As adults, we have lost our childlike fantasy and have established rigid boundaries and put limitations on our lives. We fail to see these boundaries and live lives that seem to be free, but in reality are frozen solid in place. We fail to see the beauty that each moment of life brings to us, and thus prevent ourselves from seeing the direction and course we are to take in life. Becoming a child creates fluidity, openness, and flexibility so that our lives can move forward in peace. Seek love with a passion and freely give this love to others and you will grow. Recognizing love as a needed part of life is the first step in growth. Freely giving this love away provides the motion and direction needed to allow your inner energies to mix and to multiply. It is through this passion that you obtain the energy needed to move forward along your chosen path. Live for opportunities. There is real tangible fulfillment in each opportunity you may find. By living carefully, consciously, and seeing the joy within opportunities, you will have a future full of wonder. In order to perceive wonder, you must quietly, carefully, and with intent see the gift within each opportunity presented to you. Do not live in the future, for the answers to all your questions are found within the journey called life. We generate our futures within each moment we live. We provide the means and the space in which this future resides. By spending our lives within the future, we dilute the present and prevent the future of our desires from being realized. Become truthful. Our lives are a testimony to the truthfulness of our hearts. We cannot fake truth or disguise it by living a life devoid of its essence, for the absence of truth will be seen by all we contact. Make truth an important goal in your life. By doing this, you will prevent yourself from being fooled when less noble ways cross your path. Become a person of faith, for you will find the Spirit's love in everyone you eat. Living a life of faith allows you to see the Spirit in everyone you meet. The spark of the Spirit's love is present in each of us, and we permit others to see this spark if we have the faith to see its energy. It is by faith that we see the Spirit's mark on our lives and allow others to see its presence fully within us. If our hearts are closed to the Spirit's presence, we will be unable to see its wonder in others. Opening your soul to another person creates a spiritual connection. Opening the Spirit's presence within your life creates a beacon that others will see. 
It is this beacon that will cause their inner soul to be awakened and helps their soul develop and expand. Such expansion assures the continuance of their awakening because once their soul is awakened, change cannot be denied. It is important for you to establish this connection because such connections cause growth to occur. Understand that you can only see reflections of yourself in another. You cannot see traits in others that are not present within yourself. You will see reflections of facets of your life such as poverty and loss, bitterness and regret, love and peace, and abundance and joy. All these parts help you realize how you affect others in your life. It is by seeing yourself in others that you will see the stumbling blocks that are present in your own life. You will also see all the factors that bring joy and permit growth and development to occur. You can know the message of your soul. You do this by quietly undertaking the journey into self and allow the universe to show you the desires and potentials that lie quietly within your soul. It is this awareness that will move you towards all the desires of your life and creates change in the direction of your path. You can understand completely the contribution of your soul to your life. Once you become aware of your soul, you will create the momentum to grow. You will begin to hear its message and understand its value in your life. You will then learn to see your soul's path, hear its voice, and become aware of the faith needed to succeed along your journey. Instill the Spirit's teachings into your life and your life's work. It is important to learn the messages of your soul and uncover the teachings of spirit, but it is also important to use these teachings as tools towards a better life. Without actively incorporating a spirit into your life, all that you have found, studied, and learned will to be no avail. It is up to you to put the spirit's love foremost in your life. Allow it to provide all the nourishment needed to create the budding flower of your beautiful life. Allow it to provide the rich, unbounded love necessary for you to fully actualize each moment of your life. Using these tools to create a life based on the Spirit's values will change the fundamental direction and nature of your life. It will cause you to think thoughts that will enhance your journey and provide the space from which you will grow, develop, and change the essence of your life's journey. Such thoughts will provide the opening and the links to other people and will provide the propelling force needed to move forward on your journey through life. Use them each day to create the change, the drive, and the direction of your life. Doing this will change your life forever.